Okay, from video on, we are going to the snap mode of Cinema 4D. It's very useful and important mode. Here in the Cinema 4D, you can <coughs> enable a snap. Hold mouse over of this uh, button, hold it, and you can open its subcategory or sub menu and <coughs> enable a snap. Or you can go into modeling setting. We have three tab here. One of them are snap. Here it's the snap and all setting. This is new version of the Cinema 4D, new menu of Cinema 4 The old menu of snap is here. If you click, if you um, click in the P on your keyboard, the old menu of the snap will be appear here. In a new menu, we have more clean uh, settings here. It's very nice. Okay. We want to first uh, teach you point a snap. If you enable the snap, as you can see, all of this option will be enabled. You can enable it here or enable here. If you, uh, in a Cinema 4D, if you have a purple icon, means that comment or that icon is active. So, yeah, a snap will be active here. Going to settings, the first mode is point. Okay, what does it mean if you tick the point? It means everything in Cinema 4D snap to the point. A snap to the point of the model, a snap to the point of the um, spline, everything is snap to that point. Okay, give an example. We bring some cube here. And for example, it's not matter if you have a parametric model or editable model. You can increase the model here and make it editable one of them okay as you can see we have a point if you select uh, enable snap we have a uh, as you can see a window will be show here that we have a point we the software recognize the point as you can see okay for example you can simply uh draw a spline here going to the spline because we enable the point the spline is snap to the point of the cube as you can see you can simply draw a spline on 3d with a snap to point it snap the point as you can see you can simply uh, make a spline or you can draw a spline uh, at outside here and then after that you can go and uh, snap it to the any point of any object or you can uh, uh, point, uh, snap the point of that spline as you can see it snap everything to the points for example or point to point as you can see we have a point here mm -mm, sorry going to the move tool you can snap that point to the that point of the model okay, as you can see uh okay i insert another uh, cube here make it uh, smaller and even you can uh, snap the axis if you want to enable the axis you have to make that editable go into the model mode here is the axis at the middle uh, of the model click anywhere in the space to click and drag it in the 3d axis and if you in uh, make closer to the any point as you can see automatically snap in uh, that point so as you can see our axis is also a snap to that point if you want to change your axis of your motor for example going to the this part you can simply as i said before in a previous lesson enable access uh, as you can see if you enable access uh, 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 as you can see in the middle of the that access uh, cube will be appear that means we are in access mode and simply click and drag in a space to uh, changing the access of the model and simply going to the, this part and you can snap the access to that point of the model as you can see this box here it means you are in access mode. don't forget to turn it off and as you can see we have uh, we have changed our access of model very easy very easy okay if you go into the model 
you can changing the modeling or access with these two things that I explained uh, you in the previous lessons in detail you can refer them but in this snap mode we can simply snap or access any object that we want or either also snap your access of your model to other point very easy so when you active the uh, point mode everything in cinema 4d snap to the point to to the point of everything in a model you can see the uh, point mode is a basic and more important snap in Cinema 4D. Going to settings, something called a snap radius. As you can see, it's in a 10. It's 10 units. For example, going to the point mode, you can uh, either snap the edges. As you can see, any component or any element edge point has an axis in the middle of that you can click and drag in a space if you click and drag in one of this axis you cannot snap you have to be in a 3d mode of the moving or snap so click in air click and drag in air and you can simply snap the middle of that edge to the point or you can simply go into the uh polygon mode and you can snap middle of that polygon to that point as you can see we can snap anything to that point because of we are active snap point in point mode okay okay i want to explain a uh, radius for example we haven't going to the point and we want to snap this point to this point as you can see if you click on a uh, if you going most over of this point we have a circle here this is a radius if if uh, two points uh, contact that for example a radius it will be a snap you can increase that circle to a snap with more strength you can see here you can um, increase that point and as you can see the circle uh, this that circle will be increased and you can simply if you um, close that point and reach to that circle as you can see simply it suddenly snap you can increase that radius more as you can see our radius is more and if that point um, placed at that circle suddenly snap to that point okay in this case you can uh, snap two points in uh, more more distance from each other and uh, pay attention this uh, snap circle depend on your uh, this uh, view or distance your camera from model as you can see if you zoom out this circle uh, become bigger and bigger if you going close to the model this circle is smaller and smaller because of that this is not centimeter this is a unit so it depends on your camera distance from model okay i think the default number is enough you can right click or no you can change it to do any 20 number is enough for that that's enough okay this is point mode very important mode of snapping hello my friends to continue these tutorials on youtube subscribe us like us and hit the bell icon and now you will be alerted about all of the amazing videos that we release.